Hey everyone, in today's video I'm going to show you how to install Pojav Launcher on iOS and Android and play Minecraft Java Edition on your iPhone or iPad. No computer needed. I'll walk you through the entire setup step by step, so even if you're a beginner, you'll have everything running in just a few minutes. I've tested this method myself, and it works perfectly. Before starting the installation process, we need to quickly adjust a few settings to make sure the app installs and runs correctly. This part is very important, so don't skip it. First, open your device's settings and go into the general section. From there, look for background app refresh and tap on it. Make sure it's enabled and set to either Wi-Fi or Wi-Fi and mobile data, so the app can properly refresh and operate while running in the background. After confirming that, head back to the main settings menu and find battery. Open it and check whether low power mode is enabled. If it is, turn it off, as this setting can restrict background activity and interfere with how the app works. Once both of these options are set correctly, you're ready to move on to the next step. Now open your preferred browser and navigate to modlyapp.com. This website is known for offering a wide range of modded apps and useful tools. When the page loads, use the search function to look for Pojav Launcher. Select it from the search results, and you'll be taken to a page with more information. On that page, tap the Start Injection button to begin the download process. The download should only take a short amount of time. If this is your first time using the platform, you'll be asked to complete a quick verification step. You'll be redirected to a separate page where you need to install a few free apps from the App Store or Play Store. A step-by-step -step guide is shown on the screen, making the process very easy to follow. Once the verification is completed, the installation will continue automatically. For me, everything went smoothly, and the app was installed without any issues. That's everything you need to know. Thanks for staying until the end of the video. If this tutorial helped you out, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe for more guides like this. If something didn't work or you have any questions, leave a comment below and I'll try to help as best as I can. Thanks again, and I'll see you in the next one.